So how to avoid getting banned sending bulk SMS in go high level. Now, before we get started with this video, make sure to check out 30 day for, uh, free trial for go high level below. We have a free trial for anyone that want to try out and want to, uh, and that are watching this video, but basically let me go into the video. So how can you avoid getting banned? Now, the first thing that you have to have is make sure you have SMS compliance make sure you have this and this enabled because if you don't have this enabled you will be getting banned at one point in your journey you know of uh, sending bulk sms messages second of all in order to surpass the 100 messages limit per day you will need to set up automation i did a video one day um, actually i think it was yesterday on how to ramp up and increase your sms limit so make sure to watch that video so in that video, I'm explaining how you can set up a hundred messages, um, you know, uh, like limit and to surpass that limit so that you can send more, right? If you're sending bulk messages, after you send hundred messages a day, you will need to wait 24 hours and then you will be level two. In level two, this is how it's going to look like. These are the levels. You will be able to send 250 messages, you know, 500, 750, but in, you know, in between of these, like 100 and 250, you will need to wait 24 hours. In between this, you will need to wait 24 hours. So you get my point, you will need to wait 24 hours. Now, uh, next up, obviously make sure you're adding an opt uh, language, uh, which is a uh, opt out language, which is a reply stop to unsubscribe in all the first SMS sent to new contacts. Second of all, add sender information in all the first SMS sent to a new contact as well. Do not send messages to SMS in a capable devices such as landlines. Enable the number validation feature for this. If you don't know how to do it, uh, again, let me just show you here because I think, you know, this is how you can do it. So steps to enable number validation is go to the location settings page and then here you can enable the uh, number validation under the general sections of the business info tab. So this will improve your delivery rate as you can see. So that's another thing also. Do not send, uh, okay, we, we actually did that, but uh, as you can see here, make sure these are checked. So uh, these here, which I already told you about, avoid sending URL short, uh, shortened using a public URL shortener. I honestly would avoid just sending any links because again, it just looks spammy. Um, you know, you would probably know if you're getting like an SMS, it looks spammy. So make sure that business profile and A2P brand and campaigns are registered. So if you're using a toll-free number, just make sure your phone number is registered. Again, you can see that if you're going to SMS provider or manage numbers, you will be able to see that. Um, second of all, obviously, um, you know, for the future website, like make sure you have a form opt-in set up. You know, sometimes in the verification process, it, they will ask you about that. But overall, like, don't do anything illegal. Don't do anything spammy, and you know you will be able to go and uh, you know avoid getting banned sending bulk SMS messages. So as you you can see, good to have is add opt-in language so contacts are actively double opt-in via SMS and web form checkbox. Again, this is how it would look like right here. I know this is not the most appealing. Um, obviously, it definitely isn't, uh, but it definitely helps, right? Because you know, you will be able to mitigate the, uh, get, you know, getting um, banned. So that's something that you can do as well. So yeah, these are some of the best practices for SMS deliverability. Again, use some common sense as well uh, for this. Again, don't do anything spammy or anything that will, uh, you know, um, you know, put your business in danger and put your SMS sending in danger and your phone number as well in danger. Because if you're getting banned, then it's it's a whole, uh, a lot of mess behind that as well. So uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much how you can avoid getting banned sending book SMS in go high level again Make sure you're complying with the limit as well And that's pretty much it, right? So obviously we have a bunch of other go high level videos on our channel If you want to check out our 30-day free trial if you want to opt into free trial uh, for go high level below You can do that as well. And yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching